myself, but I would look back at my uh, timesheet. I have like a book where I write down everything, all the horses I ride, instead of an actual timesheet. And I've been writing down whenever I ride Twiggy too. And I thought she only had like two weeks off, but she actually had the whole month off, and I only lunged her once and rode her once during that. So now that it's January now, she's back, been back into work for the past week. And uh, we haven't actually or really jumped since Jessica Phoenix, so since the middle of November. But we've done some pole stuff here and there, and uh, should be sort of a nice low-key lesson tonight to get back into it. Um, I'm, I've brought my new helmet cam, the cam box, the one that goes under your visor so it's a little more low profile, and I'm going to try that out for the first time. I was able to use one during the summer, but it was just the original, 
time to get ready. just wanted to check back in with you quick here. I'm just arriving home. Um, we had a super fun day at the barn. I watched for most of the day and then had a really good ride on Twiggy tonight. Um, we kept it fairly low and straightforward, just getting back into the swing of things after some time off. And she was a rock star. I felt like I was a little rusty, but Twig is super awesome and she literally will try and jump from anywhere. So she saved my butt a couple of times. So... Um, we're gonna get back into the swing of things, jumping probably, hopefully once a week until eventing season, now that sort of the easy break is over for her. Um, and we, I love watching. I watched, there's probably like 
five or six other groups that I watch before my group. And it's always super interesting to watch and learn and see all the different horses and riders. And I know most of them. But it's, it's really good just as a rider to watch and see all the different things and how everybody deals with things differently. And also as an instructor, looking in sort of what I would say in my head and seeing if my instructor tells them the same things, which a lot of times it is the same thing. So we're on the same wavelength, which is nice. So that's something I feel like more people should take advantage of that don't, is going to watch other lessons, other clinics, because you can really learn a lot. And it's just like having a lesson yourself, except you're learning different tools for different horses and you can put them away in your toolbox and then pull them out when you need them. So it's a really good learning experience um, that more people should do. But yeah, so really good day. I'm just heading home. Got some A&W since it's late. And, uh, yeah, probably wrap this up back in the house maybe tomorrow. Because I'm sure I'll think of some other things I need to say. But until then, see ya.